There used to be a magazine, a monthly magazine called The Reporter, and the editor of it made an interesting suggestion. He said, maybe you should look. There was a certain amount of literature on the, f the future of nuclear war. Maybe I should review the literature on future war and see if writers of fiction had any interesting ideas about how a war might start. There were three such books. And I paid a lot of attention to the one called Red Alert because I said, this is the first plausible, detailed examination of how a war might actually get started. My article was published in uh, the London Saturday newspaper. And Stanley Kubrick was in London making a movie. And he read this newspaper, and he thought, sounds like a good show. So he called the publisher of Red Alert and got in touch with the author. And they came up to Cambridge and spent the whole afternoon and evening with me. We had a hard time getting the war started because when the, the book was published in 1958, there were no intercontinental missiles. But by now it was 1962 or three. The whole attack force wasn't any longer bombers, but it was missiles. And we, we had a hard time getting the war started. But I was always happy that I had stimulated that movie.